Good morning and welcome to the Ellie and Jared Christmas Special 2022. We've done this a lot and every year is different and special in its own unique way. And before we get into the video, I just have to say, I hope you are having such a wonderful holiday and Christmas season. I hope you've been able to spend time with your family and friends and have enjoyed the time together. We are so grateful for you. And every year we say that if you're feeling alone, let us be your family. Let us take you into our arms and feel the love and the spirit of Christmas. And I hope that in today's Today's video, you feel just that. It might feel a little different though. Everyone, except for me and Calvin, have woken up with either food poisoning or the flu. And we're not quite sure what it is just yet, but all last night, Jackson and Ellie have been throwing up. Oh, I don't like to even say it because I know it might cause that gut reaction that no one really likes to feel, but that's what we're going through today. Luckily, Calvin and I have kind of come out of this scratch-free knock on wood. That's not actually wood, that's our counter, so I'm going to knock on wood. So, I am playing Nurse Jared today. I am taking care of everyone the best that I can, and we are going to try and have the best Christmas Eve and Christmas Day possible. So come along with us because the day is just now starting. She is alive, Ellie. Ellie Belly. But what did I say this morning? You just said you want to die. And I feel so terrible. I stop saying that, but I, I tend to say that a lot. Well, I think in the moment, that's kind of how you feel. I am so sick. Ellie has not been feeling well all night and all day. So we are gonna make some soup on Christmas Eve and that is what we're going to be having. And we've literally just got movie marathons, like Christmas movies all day long. It's a different Christmas from the very beginning and that's gonna be okay. We're still gonna do some holiday traditions. We're gonna have some soup and it's gonna be good. Usually it's like Christmas Eve, we open, you know, sibling gifts and grandparent gifts. And I'm like, why are we gonna wait till right before bed? We're opening the shiz up at lunch. <laughs> that way they have stuff to play with. Jared's been a champ helping me. I thought oh. it was food poisoning. I don't think this is food poisoning. Gosh dang it. I'm glad to see the kids are at least seem to be doing better so far. I just went to the grocery store and picked up a couple things to hopefully make our day a little bit easier. But I always feel terrible. Like we never go to the store on Christmas Eve. Oh yeah. I feel terrible that you had to. And I feel sad that the stores are all open. Like I yeah. wish everyone could just yeah. have a breather, but I know that's not mm -hmm. the case. It's like, it's a mix. It's like, I'm grateful they're open so we can get these things, but I feel terrible that they are because I want them to be with their families too. Yeah. And I understand that I, when I worked at Verizon, oh, yeah. I worked every single holiday, but you know, that's when a lot of people can do things is on Christmas Eve. My dad did not do any Christmas shopping until Christmas Eve. And I still give him a hard time for it. Merry Christmas, Ollie. Merry Christmas. You guys having a good day? Yeah. Good. We're happy to see you on Christmas Eve. Tell your parents that I said hello, okay? Okay. <laughs> and all I see is your hand. <laughs> Can I tell you more than anything that I love that these guys have kept up a relationship and a friendship for eight plus years. How amazing is that? I love that so much. Jackson and Ollie, Finn and Calvin are best friends. I love that so much. So while we did get the kids gifts for the gift exchange, we haven't wrapped them yet, but they're going to be opening them either tonight or tomorrow. So we still need to wrap them. And I pulled out this wrapping paper and I love it so much. I don't even want to use it. It's like RV and trailers and all of that kind of stuff. Ellie, this is so cute. I don't want to use it, but I think it's so fun. We it's have to. Cute. Should we use it? For sure. All right, here you go. I'm that, feeling a little better. Oh, I'm so glad. Your soup looks and smells amazing. Oh, can I just give a little sneak peek? So I yep. put all of this together and it's just it's waiting to boil. Oh, is no, this? It's already boiled plenty. Well, the reason why you know that and I don't is because something happened outside that I don't think you've seen yet. And I have to show you now. As you already know, right before we left for Northern Utah, we got lights done on our house and we love them so much. But our neighbors knew that we were gone and they knew that we have cameras and they use that to their advantage. And they kind of sabotaged our front yard. 
with some giant inflatables. <laughs> <laughs> I got a doorbell notification, I got some camera notifications, and then a few minutes later, I saw all of these growing in our front yard. What the heck? So, let's roll the footage. So yeah, our neighbor and builder at 10 o'clock at night put those on our front yard as a prank. And they've been there ever since. But I'm thinking that we should probably put them on someone else's front yard. I've got a pretty good idea who we can do this to. But until that time, we have some stuff that we need to do around the house, like make cookies for Santa Claus. So I pulled out the stay at home chef cookbook and we are going to make the perfectly soft sugar cookies. Oh, we've got a gift. Who's that for? Calvin. And that's from you? Mm -hmm. You did a great job wrapping that, bud. Thank you. Oh, put it under the tree, silly pants, McGillicuddy. I'm, I'm getting a marker. Oh, good idea, good idea. Hi. You got your gift? Yep. You wrapped it? Yep. Let's see. Looks good. And who's it to? Tommy. Nice. And last but not least, Tommy, you did such a good job wrapping that present. Mm -hmm. And who's that for? Jackson. Nice. Should we write your name on it and his name on it? Yeah. Okay. There you go. Put it you away. almost didn't catch it. All right, it is three o'clock and we cannot wait any longer. We want the kids to have something to play with today while uh, we're feeling a little under the weather, right? We are going to open presents. Yes. From Grandma and Grandpa. That's right, Grandma and Grandpa. And should we do our gift exchange gifts too, Mom? What do you think? Mom says yes. All right. Now, in your family, I want to know, do you go from the oldest to the youngest or the youngest to the oldest? There was always an order when you open presents. Ellie, what was it like in your family? It was usually, I think I remember it being youngest to oldest. Mm -hmm. But I also think there were times where it was oldest to youngest. I think it just depends. Yeah. Well, I know that Jackson has always been gracious and wants the youngest to go first. Is that what you said? Yeah. Yeah. Even right now? Yeah, he just said that. Are you that. sure? I yeah. don't care. Oh, that's sweet of you, bud. Do you want to go first? Yeah. All right, go ahead. Open her up. Open. I just have a box. <laughs> <laughs> What'd you get? What? Oh my gosh. It says it's a lab set. Thank you, Grandma, Grandpa, makeup. That's so nice. It says it's a lab kit, so we can do some experiments. Can I open it? And yeah, of course. Okay. Ah! Yeah! And now it goes on to me. All right, let's see it, Calvarino. Hey, hey I told you. <laughs> you didn't say anything, silly. Oh, <gasps> what? Do you know what that is? I saw these from Mark Wilbur. 3D pen, 22 pens. That looks so cool. Like I can 3D put... pens are so cool. They're so fun. It, yeah, and I'm never going to let you use it. <laughs> Just kidding. <laughs> I've let you use my 3D printer for a long time. So, yeah, I want you. <laughs> <laughs> These jokes, oh my gosh. Thanks, Grandma. Calvin's dry personality sometimes gets me. He I'm is. like, where is this going? He is so dry. My turn. Let's see it. I'll put this up. What if it is another 3D pen? No way. Is that what it is? Yes. It's a 3D pen. Now you don't even have to share, Calvin. I get my own. <laughs> I cannot wait to see what you boys come up with. Boston has one, uh -huh. our cousin Boston. He said it comes with a little um, guiding kit. Nice. Like, so, like instructions, kind of. I love that. Thanks, Grandma and Grandpa. Oh, so we're doing sibling gift exchange now. Tommy is getting his gift to Jackson. So we're gonna go oldest to youngest now. Happy birthday. <laughs> it's a nice birthday, but I guess it's Christmas. It's close yeah. to your birthday, though. True. Two Jackson from Tommy. Yeah, that's I hope I can tell if I. It is. 
Sweet, thanks, Tommy. You're welcome. You're I welcome. love these things. I helped Tommy pick it out. Pick you it. did not. Yeah, <laughs> Calvin, you are so funny. Uh, that looks so cool. Yeah. I am like dying over Calvin. Okay, Calvin, it's age appropriate. <laughs> yes, yes, of course it is. You love it. You love it. I don't really like Ninjago, but okay. You love Ninjago! Oh, I love it. You love Ninjago! Yeah, my throat. What the heck just happened? I don't know, but kids surprise you a lot. They definitely do. Okay. Yeah! Are you gonna pass yeah! out? That was easy. <laughs> <laughs> do you like it? <laughs> okay, I'm gonna put the man inside the That looks like so much fun, bud. It's like a little helicopter guy. The cookie dough is all chilled and ready to go, and Jackson is so anxious to get these cookies ready for Santa Claus mm -hmm. and the carrots for a reindeer and everything. You may do your duty. Good mm. job. Go ahead, Tom. <laughs> Duty. Let's wipe this off. Oh, wait. I think you need to flip it around, Tommy. You have to sharpen. There you go. Oh, you're finding the right spot? There you go. Yeah, Calvin, go ahead and grab one. There's a bunch of different ones right there. This has been so much fun to do this with you. The only thing wrong is we're sick. I know, but everyone has I'm washed not. their hands and we're good to go. I'm not sick. Oh, never yeah. mind. Calvin, you and I are the last ones who remain. <laughs> Good. It does, doesn't it? Right. Now it? try and punch it out right here. Don't actually like, punch it. Yeah, you're right. I shouldn't have said punch it out. Push it out very gently. Sometimes you gotta like shake it. Yeah. Oh, good work, Tom. That's awesome. Nice. Calvin, you're doing a Christmas tree? Yeah. Nice. Oh, Christmas tree. Oh, Christmas tree. And while these cookies cool, I think some of us might take advantage of some new lighting and take a dip in the backyard. Pool <laughs> party, anyone? <laughs> now I thought because it's Christmas, it would be fun to have green lights on the house and green lights in the pool. Are you ready for a pool party? <laughs> Oh my gosh, this is so cool. It's like our entire house and pool is from the Grinch. <laughs> Look at that. It's all so green. Isn't that crazy, guys? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Boy, we are nearly not making it to cookie decoration time. I am like so exhausted. But we are getting our cookies that we made decorated for Santa Claus. You guys are doing a great job. This one's for me, but I will make Santa one. All right, the scene is set. We have carrots, we have cookies, and we have milk. And the living room is all ready for Christmas morning. Let's go say goodnight to the kids. It's been a long day. It's been a completely different Christmas than we're used to because we've been sick. And in fact, I feel like me and Calvin have been the troopers of all of this not feeling sick. And I'm starting to feel a little twinge at the top of my tummy. So I'm really crossing my fingers, hoping and praying that I don't carry on the sickness like Ellie, Jackson, and Tommy. All right, guys, it's time for a fort. What's going on in here? Is this where you guys are sleeping tonight? I love this. This is so much fun. So, who's excited for Christmas morning? Me. But I need a drink. Okay, I let's go get Santa's a drink of water. I don't think Santa's here yet. It's still pretty early, nighttime wise, but it's pretty late for you guys. All right, my boys. Did you guys have fun today? Yeah. Even though it was kind of a, just a little sicky day. 
Well, I hope tomorrow's a lot better. Yeah, yeah but I'm still better. Oh, yeah, I'm glad. I just, I was throwing up and coughing and... <laughs> but now you're a little better? Yep. Yeah. I'm all better. So we're going to get a good night's sleep, and then tomorrow we're going to play and have fun. Yeah, but for now... We got Santa a cookie! Yes, we did. But for now, I will say this to you. Merry Christmas to all, and to it's all. all a good night. That's right. Thank you, Jackson. Bye. We'll see you in the morning. Bye.